How's it going, everybody? Welcome inside the Citrus TV studio for a No Pulp webisode. Joe Puccio, Ben Spector with you. Ben, we were watching college football all we weekend. Were. We were on the couch the entire time watching college football, and we saw a lot of poor quarterback performances. Caleb Williams, Drake May, J.J. McCarthy, Michael Penix, some guys that didn't really show up this Saturday. Who, or which quarterback, I should say, had the most underwhelming performance to you? Look, you might think I'm leaning Michael Penix because of the two interceptions, and he's had multiple games where he's had at least four touchdown passes. He's one of the best quarterbacks in all of college football. Yeah. I'm going Caleb Williams. Look, when the lights shine brightest against Utah in a big-time conference matchup, Caleb Williams just fell flat at the end of the day. He had a ball where he snapped it, wound back to throw the ball, and it just fell out of his hands. Caleb Williams has the lights shining down on him as the number one prospect in college football, and ultimately he didn't step up in a big game. Yeah, I know the show is all about debating, but there really isn't anything to debate there. Caleb Williams, he just didn't play like Caleb Williams. And if you want to talk about other quarterbacks, you mentioned Michael Penix, right? He, he could be the leader in the Heisman race after this week, and don't get me wrong, he's one of the best quarterbacks in the country, but you have to do it week in and week out. And Michael Penix, alongside J.J. McCarthy, Jalen Daniels, some of the other quarterbacks in college football, it just wasn't his weekend. And so I think now with a lot of these games going into conference season, you've got a lot of tape on these teams, you have rivalry games coming up, these quarterback plays might regress to the mean a little bit, but I mean, it just wasn't a great week for any of these QBs. Michael Penix had a fumble late in the first quarter that sort of threw off his rhythm. But still, I know wins aren't a quarterback stat. They're not. But Washington still got it done. And that defense That's stepped right. up. But Michael Penix, I think this performance is an outlier. I still really? think that with all that college football experience he's had at Indiana, now at Washington, he's had a lot of games where he's stepped up, thrown multiple touchdown passes. I think Michael Penix is still the favorite to win the Heisman in my book. I, I still think it's Caleb Williams. He's Caleb Williams. I think it's the defense that USC's got to fix. Caleb That's Williams true. fight on. He's doing an all right job. <laughs> all right, make sure to watch the full show, the full No Pulp show on YouTube and OTN. That's Ben Spector. I'm Joe Puccio. Thanks so much for tuning in.